to go at Denunzio Pool in Princeton. Now, Jim Henry is going to join Dave. And here at poolside now with winning coach Jim Henry. Amazing outcome, obviously. And it, it feels like it was just building even since last year. How much did you learn and how much did your team learn from last year's Ivy Championships that led you to this point? Uh, a lot. I, I think that uh, it's an incredible league. And I think that you know the, the teams that have been on top are, are doing some amazing things. We, we beat an incredibly tough Harvard team today. Uh, major kudos to them. But this has been in the works over the last four years. It's a culture change. It's a commitment level. Uh, I, I feel like this, this team win is 34 women committing to themselves and each other uh, and making it happen. It, it didn't just happen in the last couple of weeks or last months. This, this has been, they wanted this for a long time. Last year we learned a lot, we got close, it hurt a little bit. Uh, we made an even bigger effort uh, over the spring and summer to do the right things. We have an incredible freshman class, we have an incredible leadership. My alumni, I, I can't thank them enough for the support that they've given me. Um, I just, I don't know what to say. Uh, thank my family, my coaching staff does an amazing job. The divers were phenomenal all weekend long. Just a, a great feeling. Yeah, from top to bottom, and I spoke with Chris about that, yeah. uh, the cohesion for, between the divers and the swimmers, you mentioned it as a culture. I mean, I think that's a perfect way to describe yeah. it. You know, we started lifting weights together. And when that happened, it brought the intensity of that relationship to a whole nother level. Um, you know, it's, there are different sports, but we found ways that we could work together and the respect level went through the roof. Um, we, our divers are amazing. They work really hard and, and our team understands that they wanted to get better after last year, they got better and they proved it. It was awesome, it was an awesome showing. Uh, it was awesome to be here, no doubt about it. Just an uh, incredible team win from top to bottom. Congratulations. Thank you very much, I really appreciate it. My pleasure. Thank you guys. Thank you. Alex, back up to you. Thank you Dave and thank you to Jim Henry. Congratulations to the Yale Bulldogs who come out on top with a final to point total of 1,681. Just a monstrous final total there at the end. And when you take a look back at point totals over the course of this championship and a brief look at the record books, that uh, appears to be the most that any team has ever clinched. Only on a few rare occasions has a team gotten more than 1,600 points. Yale almost gets to 1,700, 1,681. Appears to be a, a new Ivy League championship record for one team at this event. Yale finishes a year-end meet with a victory for the first time since 1978. It's officially the first Ivy League victory championship for Yale since 1997. And for Jim Henry and the Bulldogs, very well deserved on what has been a wonderful trip to the Ocean State. Well, a lot of thank yous to go around here for this weekend. Four days of competition. We want to thank everybody with PAC Sports and our production crew here with the Ivy League Digital Network doing a tremendous job bringing you all of the competition, not just in the finals, but in the preliminaries as well. Everybody with the Ivy League for putting on such a wonderful event. The folks at Brown University and the Coleman Aquatic Center for doing a flawless job hosting this event for the second time in this building's history. I also want to thank Dave Milligan for his insight as a former Ivy League student athlete and swimmer and his great interviews down on deck. Congratulations to the Yale Bulldogs on their seventh Ivy League championship. For everybody here with the Ivy League Digital Network, this is Alex Vispoli. We will see you next year in Cambridge, but for the next 365 days, the Yale Bulldogs will call themselves champions of the Ivy League.